Do we like just not have enough? Oh god, he's gonna pee himself. In front of the whole party, Sam just peed himself. Oh no, Sam. Okay, well that's fine. Before we get into today's video, go into the description down below, find the Proper Dummies channel and hit that subscribe button. Proper Dummies is a channel that I am a part of that I upload YouTube content to every single day where we upload Minecraft and Roblox and mini games and tons of other fun stuff. See there I am right there and here's all the friends that I record with. It would mean the world to me if you guys would go over to the Proper Dummies and show your support for me on the channel by slapping that subscribe button and leaving a like on some of the videos and even comments if you choose. Now enjoy the video! Hey what is up you guys, it's Megan and today we are back with the Legacy series here on my channel, you know, where I'm playing myself in real life and then we have Sam over there. Today guys, we are just going to be living a normal day and trying to make a lot of money because I have been working on the warehouse build to actually move my sims into because I know you guys want us to move back to the, seri or to the city because the series name is City Living. That's because that's when I started this and originally Sam and I, we did live in the city. So we will be moving back to the city within the next couple episodes, but right now I don't think that we have enough money so i just really want to make sure that we have that so first megan needs to eat she needs to take a shower because she has work coming up very soon does sam have work today he's working two days it's like he just doesn't work at all because it's like he makes so much money whenever he goes into like his three days at work but he just doesn't work at all so it's always really hard for him to get promotions and stuff like that so i guess we will just go ahead and have him start to work on this intelligence database or whatever so we are going to go to web um, browse intelligent database because that's I guess what he needs to do. He also needs to take a shower So we will worry about that a little bit later. All the kids seem to be in a very good mood, but still let's use the restroom And then we can grab her a serving of this eggs benedict Megan just made and then we have kit So I need to make sure all the kids also did their homework Because that's important. Megan is singing in the shower and she's so loud She's just so loud So I'm gonna have all the kids Breeze through their homework. Why do you have a full grill in your inventory kit? I mean, Jim, I'm so confused as to why this is here. Just put it down. What is this? Why is it? Hello? Why do we have this? I'm confused. I mean, we'll keep it. I mean, I'm sure it was here at some point and I just moved it. Maybe to make room for that thing, but that's fine. So what we are going to do with the paintings, of course, is we are going to drag them to Sam's inventory and then sell them through Sam's wallet so that he can work towards his fabulously wealthy uh, milestone. So he needs to have earned $75,000 to feel pretty comfortable um, with his life, I guess, to have earned that, even though he's just selling my paintings. Don't question it guys. Don't question it. So if we complete this we get the reward treat shrewd shrewd sims will Receive a direct deposit each week based on their household funds That's cool. So Maybe that'll be a really good amount of money. Hopefully it's not much But like if we get we get more money for just having money Sam So come on. We're, we're gonna need you to get some promotions. We're gonna need you to earn this $75,000 Once Megan gets home from work. We are gonna be having her do a lot of paintings um, it looks like Sam's royalty check just came in. Let's see if we can have Megan work very hard at her job. Just to see if we can get anywhere close to getting our next promotion. We just got this promotion. We're a patron of the arts, so we are already level 7 of that. I'm just worried that we aren't going to really be able to afford this warehouse. Stella, just put this on the ground, please. Not in the sink. Just on the ground, not in the sink. But, yeah. Ooh, that was a close one. Just put it on the ground so I can sell it in the money trash can, please like $60 that we need there we go I want to be at $50,000 before we move out just sitting here I don't know what the house is gonna be worth whenever we sell it but I really do want to be able to make sure that we can afford everything and I will give you guys a sneak peek at the end of the episode of the remodel that I have going so far it's not finished yet but it's getting there um, of the warehouse I mean so, kids, why don't you do something useful like hang out? No, don't hang out. A lot of you guys also suggested that we should get all the kids' skills all the way up. Bowling, that one's not going to get all the way up. That one's too hard. But creativity, mental, social, and motor. So, we can have some of the kids play 
on the playground a little bit soon. I'm going to have to turn them into teenagers. Maybe whenever we move to the warehouse, that's something that we'll do. Because they have been kids for quite a long time. Let's see. Yeah, they, they're, they've they been kids for a very long time now. So hopefully we will be able to age them up. Let me know what you guys think. Do you think that the twins should become teenagers? That's the one thing I'm going to ask in the comments from you guys today. So just let me know about that. It looks like somebody broke the shower here. So we're going to have to repair that. Sam's handing his skill is level 7. So we are really close to having it at level 10 to where we can go visit. Oh my gosh, and the toilet's broken. Sam's gonna have to repair everything really fast before my sim bag gets home in the next 20 minutes. I doubt he'll do it in that time crunch. But if we get the level 10 handiness skill, that means that we can go to the secret world. I can't remember where it is. I'm gonna have to look that up on Google. But I'm excited for that. That's gonna be a whole episode in itself. So Sam, hurry up and get to that level 10 of the handiness skill if you would, please. Let's sell this. Nice. Sam, does, does he have anything in his inventory we can sell? We have some upgrade parts. But I think I want to keep these on us just in case, um, just in case we want to like upgrade some stuff in the future at our next house. Because I think we will. That'll probably be the last time we move for a very long time. So I'll put these upgrade parts in Sam's inventory, the one that Megan has. And there. And as soon as Megan gets, oh no, she's feeling too tense from work. Very tense. Oh my gosh, look at her little icon right there. So Megan, come on, let's go over here and let's do... Play a game, play refugee, and that should get us in a good mood. Cause it's just like our fun and energy that are a little that are a little bit down. I wanted to do a couple paintings with her today just to try to make that money. Hopefully one of them is a masterpiece, but you know, we're taking our chances with that one. And I think I even bought the um the trait that means that most of my stuff will be more yes, we have a bigger chance of it being like a masterpiece or the stuff that we craft is with more simoleons. Let's go ahead and see if we can do something along those lines. Oh my gosh. We're gonna be a real adult soon. <laughs> so in the reward store here, we have great storyteller. Always welcome Jim Rat. Um, create a visionary. Um, visionaries are a higher chance of painting and writing masterpieces. So we need about 500 win points before we could do that. So let's see, search for vampire information on computer and play an instrument. I probably can't do an instrument, but it looks like we have quite a few ways to go before we will have enough to get that whim. So let's actually just stop doing this and we can, like, we just gotta start somewhere. So we're gonna search for some vampire secrets. And I don't think that there's an instrument here to play. I think there might actually be like a little violin practice. This violin is specially built and sized for children. Well, that's rude. I think that they should let me use it anyway. There's no need to discriminate against my size. <laughs> the romance festival is in town. Maybe Sam and I can go on a date there. But I think I truly just want to um, finish a painting and have that go very well. Because look at this. It's even our whim. Finish a painting. Easy, Megan. You're making life too easy. So we're going to do a classic painting, a large classic painting. Because those sell for the most money. Um, and we have a little bit of the vampire lore information now for some reason. Oh, it looks like our blackberries are starting to bloom, um, so if we can harvest those. I only see, like, a couple. Not a lot. So we do need to water the plants. So there's a quite a few things that Megan needs to do, but actually I could probably have Sam help out with this by maybe just clicking water all the plants. Let's check on our toddler, see how he's doing. He's a little bit hungry. He just had a bath. Sam just bathed him because he's the best dad ever. Look at him go. So let's open this up. Let's put this food right here. Just somewhere where we can grab it and grab a serving for Andrew. There we go. Now it's empty. So we will throw that thing in the garbage. And yeah, we're making more money now. Ooh, and Sam can harvest these. Harvest all. Maybe Sam will get the gardening skill here. <laughs> I wanted them both to kind of do it. But if Sam just ends up being the one that does it, all the money goes into the same pockets, right? So four, four blackberries of normal quality. Only worth $44. Let's go ahead and sell some of these upgrade parts. I'm sure that we will collect more by the time we need them. So these computer parts, that's $240. This worth how much? $120. And then how about this one? $70. Not that much, but still worth a good amount. I hope that this one's a masterpiece. It looks like it could have been. Could have been. Oh, Haley just invited us out to dinner. 
Um, oh no, I wanted to accept the thing from Haley, but it looks like Tyson beat us to it, so maybe we will schedule an outing. It's 8.30 p.m., so let's go ahead and let's, uh, oh, it's still letting me paint it, even though it's done. Uh, <laughs> sell to Art Gallery, it's only worth $900, we can do better than that. Let's see if we can call our agent on the phone. Maybe he has something for us. Negotiate with agents, see if we can get some money. And then let's sell this to... I don't know if we get more for selling it to an art gallery or a collector. Uh, let me look real fast. Okay, ju this just in. We gotta sell it to the art gallery. So that will always sell for more. Oh, Megan's like, why did you wake me up? I was sleeping. Yeah, maybe, maybe Megan shouldn't go out tonight. Maybe we should just go to sleep. I like how Sam is just taking a bubble bath over there. But hey, look at Andrew. He's dancing with his sister Stella, who is sick. Good thing we have some medicine. Look at her. She has, um... This moodlet, which is scratchy, it feels like if there's a swarm of invisible insects marching all over her skin. But it's only going to be on for 50 more minutes, so do I really want to waste medicine if she's only going to be sick for 50 more minutes? I don't know. Stella, why don't you grab some food? Sam, what did you break? You broke something. Gosh, repair, clean. Oh wait, not Megan. Megan needs to go to sleep or eat or something. Maybe let's uh, serve dinner. Chicken stir fry. Why not? Sam... Come here, repair, clean. There we go. Sam's handling skill should be level 10 by the end of this episode. Not actually, but I wish because I feel like, you know, it, I just feel like he's always repairing stuff. Okay, so this Justin, Megan woke up, she took a bath, and she ended up in her formal wear because for some reason, every time she takes a bath, she ends up in our formal wear, <laughs> um, but she is making some silly gummy bear pancakes because she was feeling in the mood. Um, we're making a party size because the party size is always the best size because then I don't have to make food for a while. We can just kind of stock up on, stock up on food and then everybody has food for a good amount of time. So let's go ahead and finish these up with our crazy level 10 cooking skill. Hopefully that goes towards the gourmet skill because, you know, they're pretty gourmet if I do say so myself. Those actually look very good. So go ahead and grab a serving of those. We'll put the rest in the fridge for the kids in the morning. So look at this. Whenever we open this up, we have so many options for food. We have seven of those, five of those, and seven of those. So we shouldn't be running out anytime soon. It just always makes it so much easier to like just grab and go. To grab food and then go. <laughs> Everybody's always singing in this house or something along those lines. Sam just woke up, so I'm having him use the restroom, and then I'm going to get back to him working on his handiness skill and doing some crafts of things that we could sell over here. Megan is looking pretty good on sleep, so I think I'm going to wake her up before work so that she can work on some paintings. A playful painting? No thanks. I think I just... Why are we still wearing formal wear? Classic painting, large classic painting. Well, is this going to help the painting be more fancy? Just turn out better, hopefully? Let's see. Okay, this painting is usually a masterpiece whenever we get it. So hopefully we can get it. And what is this? We have to go to work? Dang, can we be a little bit late? Is that okay? We don't, we only make $420 whenever we go to work. We make like 900 every time we do a painting. So I really don't feel like we make very good money whenever we go to work. <laughs> Just finish the painting. Oh, that noise sounds like it was a masterpiece. Yes, it was. Okay, Sam, can you come sell this to an art gallery? Create a copy, sell to art gallery. $5,000. That is such a good price. Yes. Please take this away from us. Yes, $5,000. That's fantastic. And now Sam has a bunch of sculptures in his inventory, which we could sell for money. And I'll just put Sam over the $50,000 mark. So he's earned over $50,000 in his lifetime. And we are just really hoping that he will be able to get to that $75,000 eventually. Now let's look at the law traits. I don't think I've looked at these in quite a while. Sunny aspect, homie, all this stuff. We're gonna take away the good grades. We'll probably take away the homie. We're gonna add um, the home studio one because the paintings and stuff will come out better quality, which means hopefully some of them will be more masterpieces. And also I think we're gonna make it a party place so that whenever our friends come over, we can actually throw successful parties for once. Okay, so Sam has to go to work. I feel bad because Andrew's gonna be left alone. Either the kids are gonna watch him or everyone's gonna have to go to daycare. Let's send everybody to daycare. Bye, Andrew. He's gonna fade away. Goodbye. And then he's gonna come back in three or four minutes when Megan comes back from work. Because I know that she 
gets back pretty much immediately. No, oh, he's sad now. We can continue to potty train him though, I think. Oh, he doesn't need it actually, so never mind on that one, but we will clean this because that looks very disgusting. And we could do another classic, large classic painting because we are trying to get that money, guys. Can I steal this pile of garbage that's over here? Like, why is there garbage just right here? I, can I have that? We're uncomfortable. We didn't finish the painting. Oh no, look how in dire need of everything we need is. So we're gonna eat. Oh, God, we can't do anything because this kid's in the way doing push-ups. What are you doing? Oh no, Megan's gonna pass out from sleep exhaustion again. Dang it. And I, I don't get, it's like, she always has to come right here to this corner to do it because I guess it's the closest part to the shower for some reason. I don't know. Once she gets her energy a little bit up, we will send her to sleep. I don't know how Sam's gonna feel whenever he comes home, but I think that we should rehire the maid. Um, just because we have a lot of things go wrong a lot. Um, but the problem with the maid is sometimes they'll throw things away. Oh look, Sam brought home $760. Good job, Sam. Proud of you. But he is also so tired, so I think right now I'm gonna send everybody to sleep. So we can get through the night. It's only 10 p.m. though, so hopefully we make it through. Zach would like to come over and hang out. It's 3 a.m. Okay, Zach, why not? Maybe something's up. Why does he want to hang out at 3 a.m.? I guess I'll wake up. Uh, propose crazy scheme. Discuss neighborhood changes. Because he does live in the neighborhood now. We'll share secrets. Oh, it's it's just 3 a.m. I enthuse about new show. 13 reasons why. Did you see it yet? Did you see it? Are you aware? We're like talking to him through our doorway. That's a little bit awkward. Our sim smells pretty bad too, so I think I'm gonna send her to take a shower and then finish this painting. I still wanted to have um, a little party, so maybe Monday like 3 or 4 p.m. we can have some little get together with the friends now that I have the party place aspiration. I'm hoping that, um, or the party place like, or it's a lot trait. I'm hoping that'll work. Andrew's very hungry. Why didn't he say something? Uh, let's open. Put the pancakes out on the table. Come grab a serving of these pancakes, Andrew. I know you can do it. There, now the painting is done. It's not a masterpiece, but Sam can come sell it to an art gallery. Oh no, he can't. My Sim has to. All right, go ahead, Megan, sell this to an art gallery. $1,700, let's harvest all these blackberries, see if we can get anything for those. Maybe, like, I don't know why, but I can't evolve these bushes. They're all sparkly, but it's not letting me evolve any of them. I can weed them, I guess, but maybe I need to be a certain level to evolve plants. Because they're all sparkling. They're all in a pretty... Oh, yes. Okay, evolve, evolve, evolve. We want to get these up to where they are a better quality of bush. And I was waiting for this because I was just very unsure. So go ahead, Megan. Evolve all these. And then we will start to plan the party. Can I not evolve these? The gardening skill is going up and she's not even touching anything. I mean, I'm not gonna argue, but... Hello? Is everything okay over here? Does my sim need to be reset? Even Oh my gosh, the time is going too fast. Did she, did she do it? We can't get to this one, so we gotta move this one. Oh, there's a giant tree here. The tree never pops up. Unless it's like in buy mode. I think we should just get rid of the tree. Because I, I didn't see it there anyway. <laughs> Come on, Megan. There we go. I could not get that to work at all. Oh my gosh, go to school. Are you gonna... No, go to school. Okay, let's call and get a party going. It's 9 a.m., but that's fine, right? Pay bills, $3,000. I am sad. I'm not paying those right now. Decided to call my agent see if they could get us anything, even a $30 donation. Oh, an $80 donation, it looks like. Good, because I'm really trying to get this to a good spot. So Megan, Megan, Megan. Now we are going to throw a little bit of a party. Not, not anything big, just a little bit of a get together. We have a silver for that one. Incognito costume party. We didn't even get anywhere on this one. 
So let's do that. We gotta invite guests. Two sims are required. Everybody's invited. These kids won't be on from school for a while, so actually I'm not gonna invite them and I'm gonna invite some randoms. Just so that we can get everybody to come and everybody to dance or whatever. Megan is the host. Caterer, we don't need mixologist. Yes, we'll hire one. Yes, everybody come home from school. Why not? So talk to guests about costumes, play games at the same time, bake a hamburger cake. I can do that with Megan. Oh, she's a maid. That's cute. So cook hamburger cake. You know, gotta get food going for the party. Sam needs to make buffalo wing tea. Oh gosh, we sold our bar. We sold our bar and Bert is already overdoing yoga. Interesting. Uh, where is it? Buffalo wing tea. There it is. Sam, make that. Get people going with that. We're making a cake. We need to make two buffalo wing teas. So I'll go ahead and put the next one in this queue. Get those going. Megan is making the hamburger cake. It is finished. We need to have Sims play games at the same time. Are there Sims upstairs playing the games? No. Oh, this is broken. We're going to replace it really fast because we don't have time to repair it. Play arcade game with all these friends. Even though we really have to use the restroom. Yes. Easy. Talk to guests about costumes. Um, more choices. Friendly. Oh, there it was. Compliment costume. More choices. Friendly. Compliment costume. More choices. Friendly. Compliment costume. So we're going to compliment everybody's costume. Maybe more than a few times. Is it working? Megan is in dire need to like use the restroom and stuff. It is working, but we need to use the restroom. So I think we're going to spit out these compliments really fast. Go use the restroom. Let's go downstairs. Let's um, have Sam call people to this meal. Call the meal. Oh, is everyone going to be eating at the same time? We need everybody to eat this cake. Everybody come eat this cake, please. And then we're going to use the restroom. Does everybody know to eat the cake? It appears so. Make some tea or coffee. Eat cake, good. So we just need to continue to talk to people about their costumes, I think. We need to use the restroom, that's for sure, because if we pee ourselves here, that's gonna be super awkward. So maybe while Sam is, you know, hanging out with people, let's see if we can friendly, complain, compliment dish, compliment costume. We just gotta get some of these people's costumes complimented. Ask to leave, don't do that. <laughs> I think Sam is feeling very frustrated. I think so is my sim. We just gotta get some of these comp costumes complimented. I've just been sitting here clicking compliment costume on everybody, hoping that it'll get me somewhere. Sam, what are you doing? Did you use the restroom? Are you still eating cake? Please just go use the restroom, Sam, before you have bladder failure. Please. Please, Sam. Do we, like, just not have enough? Oh, God, he's gonna pee himself. In front of the whole party, Sam just peed himself. Oh no, Sam. Okay, well, that's fine. I'd rather have you, Stinky, mop this up. And we gotta start handing out some compliments to people's costumes. Because getting a gold on this is more important than that. So, everybody get your costumes complimented. I keep on clicking ask to leave. I'm just looking for... Oh, because I have to introduce myself to this guy. Pass. Um, more choices. Friendly. Compliment costume. We're at seven. Megan, please continue to compliment people's costumes. We're so close. Everybody pause. I'm clicking the wrong thing. We only have a little bit of time left to make this happen. This party, this one is the hardest one. This is the hardest one. Compliment costume. Can I do it with them a couple times? Compliment costume. Does it only work when Megan does it because she's the host? Compliment costume. So there's three interactions right there. If we do them, it'll work. We are at nine. We need one more. Don't chat with him. Just compliment the other costume. We won't have time to make tea or coffee because I don't have a coffee maker. Compliment the costume, please. Please. Oh my gosh. That was so close. Please just put it up to his silver. Oh gosh. Oh man, what did we get? What did we get? Stella has discovered that Deshaun is an alien in disguise. Oh my gosh. We have alien tier two. Okay, so we got a silver. That's good. I'm okay with the silver. 
But guys, that's probably a great place to end today's episode. We didn't finish off with $50,000, but we, we threw our very last party in the house. Um, so I hope that you guys enjoyed that. Once again, leave in the comments if we want to turn our kids into teenagers soon. Um, that would be helpful information. But guys, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye! Okay guys, I forgot to show you the apart the um, warehouse I'm working on so far. So I've already redesigned the entire bottom of it. I really like it. I think I might want to change this to be a different color that's not green. But this is what I have going so far. Um, you guys will get a more in-depth tour on the actual day that we move in. But here is the bedroom, the bathroom, the living room. Um, and here is the dining room and kitchen. I still have not touched the upstairs. The upstairs is still very standard. But I am thinking I want to add a door here on this like and make this like a balcony patio place for people to hang out. Um, I think that would be really cool. So there are a few more design things. I will upload a build video on it. But I just wanted to let you guys know I am working on it. And we are going to be moving in here in the next couple episodes. Right now it costs 134000 So that's why I'm just not completely sure if I want like like how it's going to go. You know like I don't know if we're going to have enough money for it. So that's why I'm like, mm, I guess we're just going to have to see. But now, thank you guys so much for watching. Sorry that I almost forgot. Bye.